Today I've got something really, really special to show you. It's something that's just arrived into stock. It is a car we've sold once before. Some of you might be familiar with it. I think it's probably the most special F12 TDF in the world and it truly is spectacular. So I'm gonna show you all the spec. Let's see what's under the cover. So here it is, a true one-of-one one specification, probably the most famous F12 TDF in the world. It has a nickname, some of you will know, it's called Il Mostro, um, stands for the monster, and it is quite well known, this car online. There's quite a few pictures and articles about it, and it is, I believe, the most special F12 TDF in the world. So we're not gonna go through each and every option like we normally do on this series, but I'm gonna point out the most important bits, the tailor-made bits, um, and starting off with this paint. So we believe it's the only F12 TDF in this color. We know it's the only F12 TDF in this color, and it might just be the first Ferrari ever to be built in this color, and it's become a real trendsetter. So many people have seen this car, and it's taken inspiration. Gordon Ramsay specced his 812 Superfast in this color. We've since seen Monzas in this color. Even 296 GTSs I've also seen in this color. So it really has uh, set a massive trend, and this was the original. It's all down to this car, and just look at this paintwork. It's obviously a factory matte paint, but it's got so much depth really deeply metallic you can see um, and I think just looks incredible. So the next thing I want to show you is the Scuderia wing shield. So normally on a Ferrari you get the badges uh, but on this car you've got the hand painted airbrush shields you might have seen those before, but have you seen them in extra large? Because this car has got extra large windshields, obviously completely hand painted, beautifully done, can't feel any edges, but what an option to have. Okay, so now onto the interior, and this is where a lot of the tailor-made bespoke features are and all the nice little touches. So the first thing I'll touch on is the carbon fiber. You'll notice this is not normal carbon fiber. This is matte green carbon fiber, actually called Verde Militare uh, to give it its official name. But you've got it all down the door panels. You've got it on the instrument cluster, on the dashboard, on the center console, back of the seats, all in that matte green carbon, even though you can't uh, see it that easily. Also no another few bits, the rear bench trim has got that matte carbon. And also, this is an option I've never seen, um, the rear parcel shelf is also in that matte green carbon. Look, I've never seen another car with this kind of tinted carbon um, in this color. And I think obviously it just goes with the whole Il Mostro theme. The only bit that's not matte carbon on the interior, is the little door sills as you enter with the tailor-made logo. And you can also see it says Il Mostro. So the next part of the interior I wanna show you is all the green fabric. Um, again, it's called Verde Militare. So all this 3D fabric you get on the seats. Um, you've got the same fabric up in the, in the roof lining. And there's also a nice little strip on the lower dashboard just down there. Um, so you've also got Verde stitching uh, all down the sides of the seats. Um, and you've also got Alcantara sort of throughout. So this cabin is just a really special place to be. And I think it's nicely done. It suits the whole theme of the car. So you've got the four point harnesses on this car as well, being a track special, but this is just a one of a kind interior and just a special place to be. Just one other small detail I like, because um, it's also part of the tailor-made options, is just under the foot mats, you'll notice the matte black aluminium. Normally that's silver as standard, uh, but as part of the tailor-made features, it's all done in matte black, also the footrests as well. I 
And one more thing some of you eagle-eyed Ferrari fans might have noticed is that this car is not specced with the F12 TDF seats. That is because the original owner said, I don't like the TDF seats, I want the 599 GTO seats. And obviously being the tailor-made program, what you ask for is what you get. Okay, so the next thing I wanna show you is the engine bay. And obviously being a 6.3 litre naturally aspirated V12, this is such an important part of the car, of its whole character and of its whole heritage going forward into the future. Um, but the nice thing about this is it's a full carbon fibre engine bay. You've also got the carbon fibre filter box covers. You might ask, why didn't he go for the matte green uh, carbon? But personally, I think that might have been a little bit over the top and this just looks classy and beautiful. What a sight. So you'll notice as well, all the exterior carbon fiber is also gloss carbon like the engine bay and it's got every carbon fiber option you can get, including this, the carbon fiber headlight buckets. Now that is a rare one that you don't often see and you'll notice these are actually in matte carbon. Okay, so this being one of 799 worldwide and obviously one of one specification, this is an ultra collectible car and the collectors will want to know exactly what the car comes with. So along with the, the usual Ferrari bits, the car cover, the battery conditioner, you've also got with this car quite a few interesting items. So first off, you've got the Classique or Classiche, um, which is basically a, a folder and a mark of authenticity to show that the car was exactly as it came out of the factory. You've got all the pictures of the car in the factory when it was built, the engine. So that's a great thing to have. Also, we've got our own little history folder with all sorts of service invoices and a full documented history of the car. We've even got magazines that featured the car, front page of SCD, um, which has got a really great article with the first owner talking about exactly why he specced it in the way that he did. And then finally, you have this beautiful matching luggage set, his and hers, just in case you wanna have a weekend getaway. But look at the details, he says F12 TDF, all in this beautiful black Alcantara. You've even got that sort of military green fabric, a little bit of matte carbon, but all together, it's just nice to know you've got all the original pieces with the car. And just in case you forget all the little different bits on this car, just under this parcel shelf here, there is a plaque uh, which just details every option on the car, including all the tailor-made, three columns of special equipment. So real good reminder that you've got a one of one spec. So there you have it, Il Mostro, a true monster of a spec, one of a kind. It's got to be the best TDF in the world, right? We'd love to hear your comments. Let us know what you think of the spec. Is it the best one in the world? Um, but look, thanks for watching. Please subscribe to our channel and we'll be back with another episode of Spectacular very soon. <laughs>